G'day Brody. can you tell us a bit about your farming operation here? I've been working with Clapham Ag for nine years now. Seven years ago we bought first round baler that prompted us to buy the first military. So we've been using one for seven years now with loading cotton modules. Next, so you've just bought a, a second machine, a 961. What were some of the drivers for purchasing that machine? Just a newer, bigger machine, IVT was a big sale point for us. Excellent. What are some of the things that you like about the Manitou? Everything really. That boom is always handy. It's surprising how often you're at full reach. Four wheel steer definitely makes it easier for loading. Forward and reverse on the joystick. And some of these cotton bales can be pretty heavy. 2.2 tonne, the ones you're loading today, they can be up to around 2.6 or 7 tonne from the newer machines, I believe. How does it handle those, those weights, especially at a bit of reach? Yeah, we've noticed a huge difference going from the four ton machine to a six ton machine. Feels a lot safer and a lot quicker loading. What about the joystick uh, control in these? Yeah, joystick operation is very good. Yeah, one hand there, one hand steering, it makes it for ease. Right, I imagine visibility is pretty important when you're operating a machine like this loading cotton bales. Yeah, visibility is important. It's great to have a good view from your seat which this allows. Another upgrade we've noticed is the cameras. Makes it very easy to seeing down the opposite side, even in the machinery shed. Uh, excellent. What about just overall the versatility of a telehandler on cotton or grain farm? Yeah, it is definitely something we use day to day. It's always missing out of the shed, someone's got it. If it's fixing ditches, doing manure, or using it for getting to high places, lifting spouts or whatever it may be. 